this is the passing package for you people i wish you all the best for your examination and try to avoid backlog in this particular subject as you already know my dear friends in vtu uh, exams if uh, somebody gets backlog later on it will become burden for the students to cover the backlog subject as these are the typical uh, vtu is setting the typical papers later on in the backlog okay so i wish you all the best and thanks for watching my video hello everyone and welcome back to my another passing package uh, video for the particular subject that is automata theory and compiler design okay so far we have discussed the passing package for computer network subject and uh, dbms subject okay if you are not watched yet i have provided the link in the description box you can watch them over there okay so today i will discuss the important questions are passing package simply how can you pass the automata theory subject there are three passing modules my dear friends and let me tell you first this is a subject where you cannot uh, expect by theory only you cannot pass this subject so you have to focus on the problematic part okay so that i have taken the uh, concepts the problematic concepts on which you have to practice a lot so that you can easily tackle the subject okay so first of all there are three passing modules uh, module one is the passing module and module two is also the passing module and the last module that is your module fifth it is also a passing module in which you have to cover this concept whatever i mentioned over here okay so first of all uh, in the module first you have to go through the uh, minimization of dfa or simply they will so they will ask uh, briefly explain dfa and uh, there will be the problems on minimization of dfa okay this is the most important problem it may be the 12 marks uh, problem over there okay so as compared to another uh, rest of the modules this module is the easier one as far as the problems are concerned okay and also the conversion of nfa to dfa these are the most important problems okay and define dfsm and minimization of it is the same as that this particular concept okay no need to focus on this much part okay sometimes they may ask like this uh, defined dfsm it is same as that of uh, explain dfa over there okay next is a uh, structure of a compiler phases of compiler most important one okay language processing system and differentiate between nfa and dfa and epsilon nfa okay these are the theoretical concepts epsilon nfa problem e closure 10 marks question may be there okay the uh, questions will appear over there next is uh, the most important that is definition part alphabet strings empty string length of string power of an alphabet concatenation of string over there okay so me passing module means uh, these three modules should be at your top most priority okay first of all you should focus on these three modules so that you can you will be on the safer side okay so uh, in order to avoid the backlogs over there so next is the module 2 which is the again passing module in which you have to cover the derivation which is the most important one that is st uh, state and proof pumping lemma and show that the language is not regular briefly explain the role of lexical analyzer write a short note on input buffering okay next important is uh, obtain the regular expression for given language so this is the problematic part you have to obtain the regular expression for the given language next is explain with the transaction diagram for reloop identifier unsigned numbers uh, specification of a token and uh, recognition of token another important topic uh, and uh, explain the phases of compiler this is the most important one where eight phases are there and you have to draw the diagram first of all focus on the diagram over there try to uh, write down the neat and uh, neat and clean sketch or diagram you can see in the paper okay so that uh, you will get at least half marks for this particular question next is the module uh, third which i will discuss later on first of all let me discuss the passing module fifth over here that is uh, define turing machine tm and working of tm turing machine problem uh, this may be the 12 to 14 marks question, uh, question over there okay you can refer also 18 scheme paper 18 cs 54 is the subject code where you can find the problems on turing machine right next is sdt problems or sdt in uh, in which it consists of l attribute sdt s attribute sdt these are the problems which you have to go through and next is uh, explain issue in a code generator design this is a super important question next is explain undecidable problem in regular expression okay this is all about the model uh, fifth over here so these are the three passing modules <clears throat> which you should go through fully so that you can avoid backlog now let me discuss the model third in which the super important question is uh, define cfg context free grammar okay and problems like problems will be like design uh, a cfg for a given language over there this is the 10 marks question definite okay if you uh, also refer the previous year question papers you will see this question first over there next is the <coughs> elimination problems of left recursion and left factoring explain the top down parsing okay this may be the theoretical question define ambiguity most important one in a grammar uh, problems related to it uh, like uh, and also you have to go through this concept dif uh, differentiate between ambiguous and unambiguous okay this may be the 10 marks question like define ambiguity and problem related to it next is briefly explain the role of parser lmd and rmd okay 
problems you have to go through and left most and right most to parse trees this is all about the model third okay so next is the model fourth over here so in which you have to go through the definition part of uh, pda and problems on pda okay next is explain bottom up parsing lr0 and slr and problems on slr or lr0 and ll1 parcel configurations and this uh, these are these are the problems on pda like a raised power and b raised power and these are the all varieties uh, which may which which you may ask over there in the examination and lr parser algorithm in which it consists of reduce action and shift action this is for only uh, those who want to score they have to uh, cover all the topics whatever I have mentioned but who want to pass they have to go through the first uh, three modules which I discussed uh, in this particular video that is model 1 model 2 and model 5 first priority should be these modules okay then rest of the models in which uh, you feel convenient if you are feeling convenient with the uh, SDD problems like sorry this one parcel uh, sorry LL1 parser configuration parser configuration problems then you should go through accordingly okay and problems on SLR so if you find difficulties in then these modules so you can neglect okay so this is all about the automata theory compiler design this is the passing package for you people i wish you all the best for your examination and try to avoid backlog in this particular subject as you already know my dear friends in vtu uh, exams if uh, somebody gets backlog later on it will become burden for the students to cover the backlog subject as these are the typical uh, vtu is setting the typical papers later on in the backlog okay so i wish you all the best and thanks for watching my video <laughs>